Hey guys, this is your girl Alicia Pink and welcome back to my channel. But if you are new here, welcome. So this is for my cancer babies. How are you? So we're going to get right into it. Um, this is for March 2021, which you need to look out for concerning your life, career, love. So we're going to get started with three deep breaths. So let's get started. Excuse me. <laughs> All right. Breathe in. <sighs> Breathe out. Breathe in. <sighs> Breathe out. Breathe in. <sighs> Breathe out. All right, Cancers. So, I would like to invite you guys to like, subscribe down below. Also, if you want a personal reading from me, everything is linked down below. Also, you know, I do readings on my Etsy shop. My Etsy shop is linked down below. Also, um, my journals, my manifestation journals, I sell them on my Amazon. It's linked down below as well. If you want more journals, I have. I also sell journals on my Etsy shop. It's linked down below. Um, yeah, guys. So, if you also want to follow me on any other social media platform it is linked down below all in the description box everything is in the description box so we just want to see exactly what spirit wants you to know off the bat march 2021 like what's going on what you need to know all right Calling in my angels, my guides, and my ancestors for an accurate message and an accurate reading for my um my cancer babes. What's going on with cancers? What is the energy surrounding cancers? Um March 2021. Okay. March 2021, cancers. Great cancer so spirit off the bat wants you to know show the world the real you full moon in Aquarius okay confidence is key new moon in Leo and a time for healing the blasphemic moon so spirit is saying next month is most definitely a time for healing for you have more confidence because confidence is the key to your success Okay, and show the world the real you. The only way you can become successful and people to like you or whatever you're trying to create or manifest is by showing people who you really are. You will find your tribe. You will find your people, you know, because there's always people and peop and, you know, a person that is for you. You know, you will always find your tribe when you show the world who you really are. Even if you think you're weird, <laughs> even if you think you're too out there, there are tons of people who are just like you and will vibe with you and connect with you on a thousand, okay? So let's see what else is going on. You are never alone. Remember that as well want me to tell you you are never alone so don't think you're alone you're not you know if you don't have any friends I'll be your friend you know you're never alone ever so don't ever think you are okay cancers all right let's see what else is going on with my cancers so these three just popped right out. So I'm going to take them. All right. So you got dragon. Slay them all. Awesome. You also have tower. Unplug. Relax for a spell. And then you have spaceship. Don't be afraid to sing. Okay. Maybe some of you got some beautiful singing voices. You know. And maybe you have some dragons that you need to slay. That's why Sarah said it's the time for healing. And by you healing, you are slaying those dragons. Those negative self-talk. Or whatever's going on okay you know also unplug you know you see this girl she's doing like a yoga pose and also she's 
um, upside down. And when you are hanging upside down, that is enlightenment. A lot of people um, back in the olden days, they hung themselves upside down so they can get more enlightened and connect more with their guides and get more spiritual blessings and downloads. So maybe try a, a yoga pose like that, you know, um, even if you can't do that, just lean back on your on yourself and put your against the wall put your legs against the wall and and do that for like a good minute or a couple of minutes and um, I guarantee you will feel better that's probably one of my favorite yoga poses and then you have spaceship don't be afraid to sing you know even if you don't have a beautiful singing voice don't be afraid to sing, you know, um, have some fun. And I also just want to say this dragon photo. I never even realized that she has a leg. Um, she doesn't, I forgot what you call it, but that is beautiful. You know, don't let your disabil disabilities hold you back. So spirit just tell them, don't let your disabilities hold you back. If any of you guys are disabled or whatever, don't let it hold you back. There's so many people who have disabilities and things like that. And they did not let that hold them back. You know, look at Stevie Wonder and um, other people. You know, they never let their disabil dis disabilities stop them from accomplishing their dreams and their goals. It just made them stronger and powerful, you know, and if you have a learning disability or a um, whatever, don't let it hold you back. Just hone on your craft. Let's see what else there has for you. I don't want to make this um, video too long. So let's get into it. I'm just talking, talking, talking. All right, so you have, when I lean on certainty and faith, I change my mind about the world I see. Then you have, through prayer and meditation, I create a ripple effect of peace in the world. And then you have, I choose to learn through love. I love that. It's beautiful. You know, um, so through prayer, prayer and meditation, you can change anything. You can change the outcome, you know. When you lean on certainty and faith, always have faith, always lean on faith. You know, you can change the world you see. You know, once you change your mindset, everything around you change. Everything's are, everything around you change. And then you also have confidence. Didn't, didn't, didn't Spirit just say confidence is key? And you got this one more, once again. In this moment, I take a step back and look at myself with the pride of a good mother. I see an abundance of abilities and talents that show up all the time in a big and little ways. If I could stick myself on a refrigerator, I would. I would invite all the neighbors over and say, look at that. Can you believe that? An A plus, that is. There's nothing wrong with bragging about yourself. A lot of people say, oh, you shouldn't brag. You shouldn't do that. Bull crap. Always celebrate the, the win. Okay, always celebrate those wins. Always. It's nothing wrong with bragging about what you accomplish and you know celebrating what you accomplish. Don't let people tell you otherwise. Let's see what's going on concerning your love life, um, Libras. Okay, you got the ten of swords. You also have the high priest, the high priestess. Okay, looks like right now concerning your love life. I feel like a, a new beginning is most definitely coming concerning your love life. If you're already in a relationship, I feel like you are in a relationship with your partner who most definitely balance you out um, concerning masculine and feminine energy. That's what I'm getting. Let's see. Or you're going to be finding someone who's going to balance you out, make you feel like the most important. You got the lover's card. This is beautiful. Um, most definitely going to make you feel important. It's going to make you the star of their reality and just love on you. Look at that. Oh, so cute. All right. You also have this three of swords. I mean, you guys will have your ups and downs like any little relationship. Some of you guys might be getting heartbroken, though. But I feel like there's going to be a balance. Really successful relationship. Two of cups, three of cups. 
so yeah this is going to be a beautiful successful relationship nine of coins is y'all guys are going to be most definitely financially stable next month as well let's see what's going on concerning your career for did i say libras or cancers i mean cancers why am i saying libras for i mean cancers <laughs> Let's see what's going on concerning your career. All right, so you have the Eight of Swords as well as the Five of Wands and the Two of Cups and the Seven of Cups. So I feel like your your finances, I mean, might be having a struggle in the beginning, but you're not going to give up easily. You're going to be fighting that, you know, maybe a new partnership. Is going to help you bring in new money, new opportunities. Okay. Let's see what else. Yeah, new money, new opportunities coming your way. For sure, concerning your career and money-wise. What else is going on concerning cancers and their love life? I mean, in their career for March 2021. Okay, you got the sun card. This is beautiful. Like, hello. Beautiful. Um, success, most definitely. A successful career. Successful abundance. Next month is going to be a great month for you if you do the work. You got to build up your confidence. You have to do the, the healing. You have to do the healing. Okay, and you, you have to celebrate those the small wins also. You know, don't let your disabilities stop you from achieving your goals. Okay? And that is your reading. I really hope it resonated with you. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. And I will catch you in the next video. Bye.